Here we're asked to find the roots of a polynomial function f of x. Now to do that, we know we have to set the function equal to zero and then solve for x. In this case, we have x cubed plus three x squared minus x minus three equals zero. We'll solve this by factoring. To factor a four term polynomial, we factor by grouping. Grouping the first two terms, we can see the GCF there is x squared. Factoring out an x squared, we'll have x squared times x plus three. Now the GCF of the second two terms is one, but since the leading coefficient is negative, we'll factor out a negative one. And that'll leave us with an x plus three equals zero. Now x plus three is the GCF, so we'll factor that out and then what's left in this case will be x squared minus one. Now we're not quite done factoring because the factor here x squared minus one is a difference of squares. So we could factor that further and we have x plus three times x plus one times x minus one. And that's equal to zero. Now once we have it factored equal to zero, we then set each variable factor equal to zero. So either x plus three equals zero, or x plus one equals zero, or x minus one equals zero. And so that gives us our three roots. x equals negative three, or x equals negative one, or x equals one.